flooding being blamed for at least six deaths across our area. Search and rescue teams have recovered two bodies from cars right near the West Loop at the Southwest Freeway. Now the work isn't over, though. The recovery continues. They are still pumping water out of the area near Post Oak Exit on the West Park Tollway to see if there are any more bodies still submerged. Channel 2's Jace Larson is out on the scene and joins us live. Jace, this is uh, just so sad. So let me kind of explain what's going on right now. There are uh, three pumps that you see right here. Just two of them are working, and they're trying to lower the water here as quickly as possible because they are uh, the believe that there is uh, one SUV that is trapped somewhere in that water, that it likely filled with water with at least one driver inside and then sunk to the bottom of this road right here. There is still some 12 to 15 feet of water down there. They're working to pump this out. It goes about a foot an hour. Usually it could go much faster than that, but there is so much debris out there that it's really slowing down this effort. The likelihood of finding this driver uh, alive is just really non-existent at this point. Cameras actually watch that driver go around a barricade and go down and into the water. Then uh, one of the people who was from the uh, toll road authority here drove as quickly as he could down here, tried to jump in and save that person, save that driver, but was not able to do it. The last thing that anybody saw was that driver either holding up a cell phone or a flashlight in the back of the SUV before it went underwater. I spoke to one of the constable um, deputies out here who kind of gave us a feel for what it was like as that driver went around the barricade and then continued to the curve that's right here where we're standing. I before last when that vehicle went through, um, the water had not come up to anywhere near the depth that it is now. So around that corner is where it gets to the, to the deepest point, and that's where we, where we believe the vehicle to be. So far, though, we have not seen any sign of that SUV. It is somewhere down. The deepest point is really well, right out uh, about in the middle of where you can see from where we're standing right here. They believe that it is somewhere down there. Lots of people use this road to go to and from work. So while this rescue effort and recovery effort continues here, uh, the road is obviously not going to be open. I talked to uh, some people around here who are working to try and clean up the debris. They say it's just going to take them at least uh, until this evening before once they get the water down, they can get all of this debris cleaned. There is a lot of work that still has to be done out here. Live along the West Park Tollway near the Galleria, Jace Larson, KPRC Channel 2 News.